Hey everybody, JPT back with Let's Build Our Minecraft. As you can see here, I've got a nether portal. Remember when we got that horse? Yeah, this is where it, where it came from. You can see the horse is taking baths behind me. It's nighttime. And so far, so good. I've torched up this whole place. Eventually, I'm going to try to do some natural light, but I don't know if that's going to happen or not. Uh, we have a horse that's not great. And uh, you know why he's not great? Because he jumped into the nether portal, I'm pretty sure. So let's go find him. <laughs> He's got the horse armor on. Although, we have extras that we can get. Yep. Dumb old horse. Oh, he's dying. And he died. <laughs> what a dumb horse. So, at least we got our stuff back, but the horse was a little bit stupider than I thought he would be, but that's okay. We can, uh, we can, we can mate these guys, right? Yeah. Horse mating. Okay, you're an 11, but are you a good jumper? Yeah, see, I can't do anything until I get these guys. So, my mission, I guess, is to go get some sugar. I was going to say, is that going to fall? Get some sugar. And I guess they mate with normal wheat and stuff, right? But yeah. Built that nether portal and I look and I'm like, where's my horse? Are you kidding me? I hate, absolutely hate the crazy lag on the nether portal. Oh, gosh dang it. And it does it even when you're... um. When I'm not recording. So it's not like a recording issue. So I'm in the nether. I've got three portals now. I've got one that goes to the end portal. I've got one that goes to the horse farm. And now that I've got one in the warehouse basement. So we're get, we're creating a network. And so eventually I'm going to probably want to build a network of tunnels that kind of lead to each other. So right now that goes nowhere. That goes down. Oh to uh well i guess technically we have more than that we have four because i have one that goes also to the uh, nether fortress and i'm not actually sure where that actually ends up in the overworld i have coordinates but i feel like it's really far away and probably not even worth messing with um i did start getting other crates down here i put some coal down here not sure I'm going to keep this. We mix it up with some black wool. Uh, it's kind of to sort of show how dirty and oily and stuff this pl place can be. I don't know. This this is a work in progress. I haven't quite figured that one out yet. And I don't know if I showed you in the last episode what I've done to the enchanting room up here. I've changed it to look more like a storage container. You know, it's kind of got the vertical lines. Almost, you know, like corrugated uh, steel. That kind of thing. Uh, I, I rather like it. I feel like I had a little bit of footage of it, but then it didn't make the edit. So uh, this is our new steel door. You open it. Or, yeah, steel, iron, iron door. Yeah, that kind of thing. It better closes, you know, closely matches this stuff, which I like. I'm thinking about changing the way this looks, but I'm not sure about that uh, just yet. Not sure about this just yet. Uh, Jay Ryan... One of our ground fox guys, the ground fox guy, said, hey, maybe change this to light blue glass. I did just that, but we're still not getting squid. So, meh, womp, that's okay. That's okay. I'm going to go get some sugar and get some wheat, and then I'm going to try to figure out uh, a creative and interesting way of fencing off our horses. So, yeah, here's our... Uh, Steel trap door. Pretty cute. I like it. I like it a lot. Let's go ahead and put that torch down. I think eventually I will build something off of this. Let's go over here to do that. I'm pretty sure horses still use wheat. So yeah, we're going to have to... What? It makes zero sense why it's doing that. I'm pretty sure that's how they mate, but... Uh, could be wrong. They might have changed that up. Maybe it's the carrots. 
Look at me trying to put wheat back in the ground. You dummy, it's seeds. It's the original. There we go. All right, so we got some seeds. Uh, probably need to grab. Let's go ahead and put those seeds away. Probably go ahead and grab some sugar cane so we can get the horses to be all sweet on us. And then we're all made them. And then we're going to test them. So we're going to have some, uh, we're going to have a testing ground. I'm going to build a horse stable, probably a much larger scale of the one that I built for my western town. Definitely think I'm going to tweak on that, maybe modernize it a little bit, get it way over there. It's a horse sanctuary, basically. So I don't know, maybe something to do with uh, what you would maybe see, oh gosh, in Kentucky, that kind of thing. Where did you come from? Seriously, this place has has been uh, free of bad guys for a long time. That's scary. Huh, look at the light levels. I'm not seeing anything crazy, so I don't know where he came from. So anyways, let me go do that. And we'll see what happens for the rest of the episode, all right? All right. Look, I found another zombie villager. He came really, or like he came out of that cave or something, I think. Because I saw him, he like walked out and he was standing up there right as the night came. It's really weird. I've been doing some cutting down of the trees. So we need to get this guy in here. And do something with him. Convert him over, I guess. Get another uh, worker in the workshop. Make sure that he can't get out. Make sure he can't get out. So how about you follow me in here, buddy? We're going to have to name you, too. We're going to have to find you a name. I think we have an extra name tag upstairs. You know, I wonder if I could... No, I was like, I wonder if I could actually get him upstairs. I think that would be a terrible idea. And yeah, don't go up the stairs. <laughs> that would be bad. Let's see. Yeah, you just... You just do your thing there. Well, you just do your thing there. Um, he's trapped at the moment. I don't know why I did this. So I've been fighting allergies. If you can't tell, I got a little bear, bear, white going on today. Oh yeah, ladies, you like my bear, white voice? Yeah, it's bad. It's pretty bird. Or is it pretty good? Mm -hmm. Yeah, ladies. It's actually the deepest. My voice has gotten in a long time. <laughs> so yeah, we've trapped him. We have to figure out where we want him. I don't think I want him in that office. I think I maybe want to give him another job. So I'll have to figure that one out. I want to save as many zombie villagers as I can. So this is the way to do it, I suppose. So, I'll have to think about that off camera. But, uh, I recorded some footage of the next thing we're going to be doing with the horses. And it was bad. Like, my allergies have come out of nowhere, it seems like. And they snuck up on me. And yesterday I tried to record it. It was so bad. I was so incoherent. I was going to say, it's not even funny, but it was pretty funny when I went back and listened to it or watched it I'm just like <laughs> then my wife called and it was distracting it just it wasn't a good recording so you won't be seeing any of that but we will go and I will show you the rough template I have for that okay so we need to name this guy so let me get or lady I don't know are there are there lady villagers I never I always just called them gentlemen uh, let's see. What do you want to name this guy? So we got Eddie. How about a Dave? We need a Dave. I feel like that's a... A guy's name that would work in a warehouse. Right there. Dave. Dave, you're a zombie. Not for long. Wait. What just happened? Did that glitch? He 
He is named Dave, though, right? Yeah. Where did that, uh... Strange. Yeah, I think... I think we glitched that. My bad. I didn't mean to. I didn't mean to cheat. <laughs> Don't call me out, Mojang. I didn't mean to cheat. Anyways, so we got Dave. He's in there. We got uh, Eddie up there. And uh, we'll head back to... Uh, maybe he'll maybe he'll be down here. I don't know. But... Uh, yeah, we'll head over to the, the horse farm, and I'll show you what I'm working on. It's yeah, it's really weird. I still have uh, still have the name tag, so I'll have to toss that, I guess. I don't want to be a cheater. I don't want to be a cheater. Well, I may have mentioned earlier that uh, I've been working on a little bit of a thing here. That's right. And I built this on camera. <laughs> I built this on camera, but I again, re after reviewing the footage, nope. That's not going to happen. So let me get rid of the bulk majority of this so we can explain what we're doing here. Okay, so get rid of that, get rid of that. Just took a shower, so my voice isn't as bird what, but I can go there. <laughs> I can go there. Wow, it's deep. So, um, went to Google, went to the Googles and searched for stable and found a pretty, pretty interesting image. It was very similar to what I built here. What I've built here, uh, roof line, we're using quartz, so we're going to need some mad quartz, which you can see in my inventory, and I think I have some over here, as a matter of fact. So I'm actually going to drop, I'm going to drop this wood off. There we go. Oh, gosh. How is he getting up there? No, thanks. I have to take care of that. Oh, I see. That's not good. Take that down. Yeah, don't need that in our lives. Wow. Okay. Well, not every, not every area is safe. Understandable. Understandable. So yeah, we'll have to build a fence. As you can tell, there's there's some bad guys that want to come out at night and shoot our faces, our beautiful faces. Why would they want to do that? So this is the stable. Uh, we'll have I think 13 pins for various horses and donkey creatures alike. And so this is kind of the perspective uh, roof line up here, which will then reveal uh, a side where we could put some windows and also a uh, front and back porch, which is really cool. Uh, this is where we would actually enter the building if these doors were not to be open, which one of these will be, as you can see. They are on barn door sliders, and I've just used levers to kind of indicate that they are attached to this would-be rail, I guess. And actually what I wanted to do is I wanted to put some spruce, some sprucey mixed spruce wood as an accent. I'll probably need more than that, you dummy. Let's go ahead and pull that in. Okay. Take this out. So oh, I'm hungry. In real life and in Minecraft. Just to kind of mix up the colors a bit. You know, you don't want to... Perfect. You don't want to be too weird. But yeah, so it just kind of offers this splash of color, I think. Uh, window up here. But yeah, the roof line, originally I had blocks up here that I thought, eh, it's just not quite angled enough that I want it to be. So we just used uh, stairs and then a slab. And then same thing here. So again, a covered porch is what we're going for. That horse has been swimming for the longest time. We're going to have to probably do some terraforming here, too. Um, might keep a little bit of the water there. He really enjoys it. He really enjoys it. But yeah, the, the front porch would be here. Spans all the way across. We'll have another set of doors here that mimics this. Uh, roof line comes all the way over. And yeah, again, pins for each one. I'm going to have to go back and watch... <clears throat> excuse me. Watch my Survival Minecraft series when I built my western town. Because I really feel good about... <laughs> this one's still trapped. I really feel good about the stables that I built for my western town. So we would probably mimic that here as well. Yep, sun is going up. And most likely we'll have... Uh, this isn't an odd number. It's an even number, which is a little different for me. I did debate whether or not I would 
put something in the middle, but I think this is the way I'm going to go. I'm going to try try it with an even number. I'm going to try it with an even number. And uh, you can hear see this hidden detail on the porch. It's curved on the inside like this. And then we will have uh, stuff, uh, fence posts, probably on the spruce side of colors. Uh, every, pretty much every th three. Yeah, so if you want me here, let me mark these off for you. If you want here and one here. So you'd be able to kind of squeeze in. And uh, basically a walk-up porch is what I'm going for. So I'm going to have to add a lot of dirt right here, I think. Should have built it one more down. And then we wouldn't have to dealt with that. But hey, that's on me and not on you. So this is pretty much what we're working with. I'm going to go ahead and get a screenshot just in case. But what I'm going to do is I'm going to uh, finish off the roof line. I'm going to use a lot of quartz. So I'm just going to go all the way over there. I'm going to basically build the meaty frame of this building and then in the next episode we'll add all the details like fence post and uh, get the horses in there figure out what we want to do with the actual uh, pins themselves that kind of thing so yeah stay tuned I'll be right back all right well here we go got myself the roof the walls everything else even the I guess the front porch is all said and done take a quick gander at it yep see roof line you can even go inside and take a look. All the pins are ready to go. There's the roof line. Got some special things planned for this. And uh, as you can see, we got the windows ready to go as well. So uh, weird number, so I had to go with three in the middle, which is fine because it matches what I'm going to do right there. But uh, yeah, got some stuff going on for the next one. Got uh, creative ideas for the roof, the pins themselves, and uh, possibly even the ground inside. So I know I'm going to need a ton of dark oak. But guess what? We're surrounded by it. So we're going to do some deforestation off camera. It's nighttime. I need to go get a bed. It's kind of weird that I haven't been attacked. But I need to sleep <laughs> at some point too. And uh, I'm going to need some wool. I'm going to need lots of wheat. All sorts of stuff. I already got myself a donkey up in here. Is he one that, I, that likes me? Do you like me? You don't mind me. And you took a while to kick me off. Do you like me now? I can't control you. Donkey hee haws. <laughs> hee haw. But yes, that'll all happen in the next episode. So again, come on back. Lots of creative stuff going on next time. So until then, this is JPT. Go play your games, and I'll be seeing you.